this recognition that the thing and my thought, feeling about the thing are not the same thing. And that my thoughts and my feelings create, actually end up creating the thing itself. We say it all the time, this stick is just a stick. You see the stick, I see the stick. Twenty people in this room see the stick. That's what this means. Put down your opinion, your idea, your thought, your belief, your understanding, your idea. Just see. That's one mind. If we hold that mind, we are one mind in this room. Your mind, my mind, Steve's mind, everybody's mind, same mind. But my opinion, my thinking, my idea, Steve's thinking, Steve's opinion, Steve's idea, different. Suddenly we've separated. Now the stick isn't just the stick anymore. There's Bunsong's stick, and Steve's stick, and they're not the same stick. And look at this world, the wars, the fighting, the disharmony, the anger, the robbery, the abuse. It all comes from this separation, this my idea, my feeling. It's very clear. We all see this stick. But as soon as I make something about this stick, I've taken it and I've made it something other than it is. So at any moment, it's possible to remind ourselves, that's what I do. It's not bad, it's not good. When Paul gave meditation instruction tonight, he said the mind will wander. It's not bad or it's not good, it's wandering mind. Come back. If you get lost in good and bad, right and wrong, you just make the matter worse. So we practice to simplify, to be able to see things clearly as they are.